Yes, what is happening guys? My name is Mr. Miola and welcome to the first ever episode of my Exile Feed the Beast Let's Play. Now, as I just said, let me hit some buttons on my keyboard. Um, as I was just saying, this is uh, something that's been requested for quite some time. And when I say it's been requested for a while, like pretty much since I started making videos. Um, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, back off, back off. Oh wow, now they're all coming. Just in time for you guys. Um, <laughs> I haven't had any trouble up until now. Um, you guys have been requesting Tekkit for, for a long time. And I always... It didn't really interest me. I've uh, put it off and put it off for a long time. Um, let's pull this away because I'm probably being a bit loud. Um, and Tekkit phased out, obviously. Uh, and recently, it's all been about Feed the Beast. Oh yeah, more diamond. That's sweet. Um, I did. Ah, Feed the beast didn't really interest me either until I ended up in calls with like all the other exile guys, and they're all. Oh, that sucks. They're all freaking out about Feed the Beast and all the awesome stuff they're doing. And uh, let's put our shirt on because it's a bit chilly down here in the depths of the the earth. Um, and it sounded so exciting. All the cool shit they're doing, like boss battles and, and all that stuff. And all I was doing was farming stuff in vanilla and building stuff out of normal wood. Um, so I decided to give Feed the Beast a go. Um, now, I haven't done a whole lot because I figured it'd be quite interesting basing this series around, like... Um sort of like reaction sort of like what do you call it like a uh, blind sort of like blind reaction style stuff because um, I don't really know what to expect I know there's a ton of these weird ass ores down here don't know what they do don't know if they're valuable I mean I could be stepping over the new diamond or something but hell I, like this stuff here could be the most valuable thing on the planet I mean look at the particles popping out of it that's cool but uh, hell I don't know I'll just leave it there uh, for someone else to pick up. Um, what I do know is valuable though, is diamonds. Uh, I have tried, like I have been playing a bit and I was, you know, it was looking pretty good. Had like all my iron and stuff and found some pretty cool stuff, but I didn't last long because I died and then I have ended up like a thousand blocks away. It didn't really see much. And um, so I hadn't slept in a bed. So I died about a thousand blocks away. And then I ran back those thousand blocks, I got to where I died and then died again with the rest of my stuff. And then I went back and died again and again and again. And the next time I starved and then I died and then it was just disaster, disaster over an... Ooh, creeper. It was just, yeah, a very bad run. Um, but without talking about any of that anymore, uh, this series hopefully is going to be an exciting and weird one. Because uh, from what I've heard, there is a lot to do and a lot to see with these mods. Um, if you're looking for a list of... Alright, i got to eat. This isn't going to go good. I'm going to end up exactly with what I've done the last few times. Do I have food? Rotten flesh, is that all i got? Wow. Um, what's it called? What was I going to say? If you're looking for a list of all the mods that this mod pack includes, I'll have a link in the description to, you know, the Feed the Beast website thing where you can find out more information if you want to play for yourself. Um, it is very resource demanding on your computer for those of you that don't know it too well. It is like it is like running Minecraft with 50 mods. That's pretty much what it is. Um, so it's pretty messed up in that sense. Like it does put a lot. You have to have a pretty decent computer to be able to run it. Um, you know, full blast and all that. Um, as you can see, we've got a, a fair few users online at the moment. We've got last username, we've got Rixior, Azdajuki, Greygeo, and myself. Um, I think we had Sugoi must have gone offline. Have they been saying anything? I don't even know. Yeah, Sugoi went offline. Who else is with us? Uh, Bruno, possibly. I, I actually can't remember. Um, but I've been sort of ducking in and out. I ended up having the house to myself at the moment, so I was like, eh, why not record an episode? Um, now, 
You would have seen my intro that I made using Cinema 4D. That's my first intro. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I released it like two or three days ago. Just as like a quick little thing. Um, and oh wow. Well, you also would have seen it at the... Wow. No, 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 no. This ain't good. You also would have seen it at the start of this episode. Um, it didn't take me long to make. I've been playing around with the program on and off for a while because... Oh, wow, 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 no, 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 <sighs> okay, no, 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 okay, stop, okay, let's, 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 I'm gonna die soon, um, wow, okay, I better, like, stop <laughs> for a second, oh, no, F3, where am I, no, 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 yes, <gasps> okay, that's it, block it up, block it up, block it up, that's half a heart, that's way too close, way too close, Wow, um, jeez, I don't even have food. Eh. Unless you can eat some of this weird stuff like sapphires and rubies, but I highly doubt that. Um, wow. What do I do? Also got this sapling, teak sapling, which apparently is pretty good, but yeah, I don't know. Um, <laughs> but I uh, hope you liked the interest, sort of, that's where I was talking. I think that's what I was talking about. Um, yeah, something something random and spontaneous, and I sort of had the idea, and I was like, yeah, free the boost. Um, I made it. I made all the audio myself. I sort of just recorded myself yelling, feed the bee, or feed me, I think I said. Um, which I think was pretty, pretty cool. Now, the problem with mining straight up right now is that more than likely I'm going to dig into a gra gravel pit which will crush me. So maybe we should avoid doing that. Um, <clears throat> and then I sort of distorted the voice to sound more like, you know, beastly, like Rix Rixia, I suppose. <laughs> um, but we are not looking too good for this episode. This is a disaster. Um, also, while I'm in this mode here, um, as you can see, I'm running not enough items on top of uh, the Feed the Beast mod pack because it's supported by Forge and Forge, well, Feed the Beast or the mods run off Forge. Uh, so here we have not enough items. Now, some of you may be thinking, oh, this is cheating, you know, you can just spawn in items. But uh, what you can do, you can actually select recipe mode. So instead of when you click on it, you know, it ending up in your inventory, uh, when you click an item, it shows you the crafting recipe, which comes in handy when you come through with all the items over here. And uh, God knows what all this stuff is, but. You know, if I want a birchwood hollow cover slab, don't know what it does. I'll hit the R button and uh, it'll tell me how to craft one. Um, I think I can also hit U. And it'll tell me the uses for it, which is cool, I suppose. Um, that was a pretty bad example because I think that's a pretty bad item. Um, I'm just trying to think. Yeah, diamond pick, why not? Let's use our first diamonds. Let's get rid of F3 mode because that's just annoying. Let's keep digging up. Ooh. See, there's so many just cool shiny ores and stuff. It's pretty cool. Um, let's probably take this with us because we don't have a lot of wood either. I hope it's daytime. That's for sure. Um, yeah. And uh, in the top left there, it's another thing I keep forgetting we got there. We got a little mini map there. Which is pretty cool. Um, something I'm not used to using, so I keep like forgetting to look at it. But uh, hey, it may probably come in handy. Um, which sort of brings me to another thing. How high are we? 44. Okay. Um, which brings me to another thing. Because I'm pretty clueless when it comes to Feed the Beast, and I don't really know what I'm going to be expecting, or what the possibilities or any of that are. Um, okay, before I get any further, we are running the Die Wolf 20 pack. Um, not the Minecraft pack or any of the others, it's the Die Wolf 20. Die Wolf, yeah. Um, which, I don't know, I think a few of the mods are different, I don't know the exact difference. And we may be upgrading to the Ultimate pack, so just to like clarify before you guys go suggesting stuff that I can't uh, do for you guys, which would be a shame. But um, like you guys, I know some of you, like some of my subscribers, I'm really scared to go up there. 
We seem good. I really gotta find food. Yes, there he is. I gotta get this health up before something bad happens. Um, where's the pork? Down here. Um, let's get rid of our bones. Yes! Okay, um, now I know some of you guys are pretty uh, used to tech it and feed the beast and stuff like that. So I want to get suggestions from you guys as I go with the series on things you'd like to see me do. Um, from what I've heard that there's a lot of there's a lot of different possibilities and stuff that you can achieve. Um, I just don't know what they are yet. But uh, hearing you know those that sort of stuff from you guys would uh, be very very nice. It'd help out as well. Uh, so, you know, if, if there's any suggestions or things you'd like to see me do, feel free to comment. Let me know in the comments um, or on Twitter, whatever. Whatever is easier for you to sort of contact. Yeah, just uh, do it through that um, because I will have very little idea on what I'm actually doing. Uh, so as you can see, the world is pretty uninhabited around here. Um, there isn't really a main spawn like there is in our normal Exile server. Uh, there is like some everyone sort of split up done their own thing which yeah kind of makes sense since it's sort of like a secondary server to the vanilla server um, but f I don't know from what I've heard we got like hubs and stuff in the Twilight dimension don't know what the Twilight dimension is but it'll be cool to go check that out someday um, along with the rest of the world because check out the size of this ravine. Wow. I don't know. It just looks big. I don't know if it is. I'll be honest. But that looks like a really big ass ravine. And here we got one of the new biomes. So uh, there's a ton of new and exciting stuff uh, in this mod pack. That I'm going to be seeing for the first time. So hopefully you guys will join me along the way. And uh, sort of experience it first hand with me. Um, I'm sure it will we'll come across some pretty exciting adventures and I'll try to keep the episodes, uh, you know, fairly uh, exciting and not boring. Like, to, obviously this episode is a bit of an intro just to let you know what's, what's going to be happening in this series um, because I really have no idea <laughs> and I'll sort of be planning it out as each episode goes. Um, but yeah, you could probably expect to see some co-op sort of stuff because I know a lot of the guys do a lot of uh, co-op things together speaking of which we should probably have yeah okay cool I was about to say we should probably have killed those sheep because we're gonna need a bed soon or maybe not a bed but we're gonna have to set our spawns somewhere uh, or else we're gonna be in a bit of trouble aluminium ore I don't even know if that's good or not but we'll keep it anyway um, and yeah there's like uh, there's just so many new things I just I'm so inexperienced about but I can't wait to find out about like there's like hover packs and like rocket boots and stuff. I, I don't know what that is, but it sounds cool. <laughs> That's the main thing, I suppose. Um, let's, yeah, okay, cool. While I got a time, let's pop that in there and some iron in there. I'm going to need some wood to craft my bed. And who knows? I don't know. I'm going to need a place to stay. I hear a pig. Yes. Give me your food. Give me your pork. Put that fork. <clears throat> Put that pork on your fork. Uh, one more. Come on. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Speaking of which, we can make our bed. Sweet. So we can finally uh, call a place home, I suppose. Um, but I think I've pretty much covered everything. Did I hear a zombie? I don't know. Uh, everything that I've wanted to cover this episode, I think. I got the, got all the, the basics. I'm trying to think. I can't remember. I didn't mention that I'm here in webcam with you guys either. Uh, which, oh, but at this point, is something you can expect to see in... This series, maybe I'll make it like a, like a feed the beast thing, the the face cam sort of stuff. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, but you know, poss possibly, it may be a you know a regular thing for all the feed the beast episodes. We should probably box ourselves in, um, before we find ourselves in a world of trouble. 
Um, but yeah, honestly, keep an eye out for this series because I have high hopes for it. I think it will be fairly uh, a fun and exciting series for you guys, for me, and uh, I suppose, yeah. Uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy it as much as I will hopefully enjoy playing it. But uh, I guess that's up to the individual. And I'm running out of building blocks, which ain't too good. Oh, no, we got we got more cobble. We're good. In our little cobble tree house here. Um, now, for those of you that are watching this episode, I'll give you a little uh, sneak peek of an idea that I'm actually working on my very first music parody. Um, at this point, anyway. Hopefully, hopefully it all goes according to plan and it releases and all of that. But uh, that is... What I've been spending a lot of time on at the moment, and all seems to be looking pretty darn good, which is uh, really cool actually. But uh, it's very exciting, something I, yeah, I've always wanted to do, but I've never really uh, thought that I would actually do, if that makes sense. So that's, it's it's exciting. It's exciting. I've uh, got help from a few friends, uh, helping with lyrics and stuff. I hope hope to have it animated, uh, like in Cinema 4D or another program, so that'll be pretty cool as well. Uh, let's sleep in this bed, but um, I can't really say too much more about that because I'm not sure what to expect on that one there. Um, but I think it is about time to call it an episode. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If uh, well, if you did, then keep an eye out for the rest of the series. I'm sure it'll be somewhat of a fun one for everyone. And, uh, yeah. I don't know what else there is to say, but if you did, leave a like. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And most importantly, have a nice day. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.